Good morning. So we're going to do on this video a little of the reclaim process. So you've, there are a couple videos previous to this where there was dry clay put in a bucket, water was added, it all kind of uh, slates down the water absorbed into the clay, kind of disintegrated into powder. It has been a bunch of time since then. Time passed. Uh, um, and now I have one, two, three buckets filled with the clay. Ooh, that is heavy. Like that's kind of what it looks like. It's like this gooey, this has been like a long time. So it's kind of this like gooey, sticky, like that's too wet to use. Sometimes it's a lot sticker than that. Down inside, it's gonna be like super gushy, I know, because this top has been exposed to the air for a while. Um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull this out because it's too wet. I'm gonna pull it out and I'm gonna put it on these boards over here, all of these boards, and they're also like two long boards over there. So this is an entire table surface. I'm gonna pull it out, put it on those, um, which will expose it to the air and kind of have form these little logs. Those logs are going to dry out. The moisture is going to go into the air. It's going to evaporate. That clay is going to dry and harden up a little bit. And then I'm going to run, I'm going to like monitor, check it, poke it, and figure out when the right time to is to like cut it with a wire and send it through the pug mill. Um, when it goes through the pug mill, the pug mill is going to mix it, make it a make it homogenous. I'm gonna like feel how it is, like how much it is. I'm gonna add wetter clay, harder clay, and just kind of play with that mixture to create that soft plastic clay that we like to use and is good to use. And it'll vacuum out the air, spit out a little tube, and then we can use it again. Wedge it to throw, make sculptures out of it. So all that clay that was dry and you're like, oh, we're done. It's the recycle process. So there's my little intro to this and uh, Next videos are going to be the doing. It's work. If any of you have, I liken it to like mucking out. It's like mucking out a bucket. Sort of if any of you've worked with horses or horse stalls, the horse has a stall. It's got uh, straw and chip wood chips, wood shavings, and it just like uses that as its restroom. Like, and it kind of gets dirty and you got to muck it out. You take your little uh, manure pick and you scoop up the main things, you get rid of that, you add some more shavings, you keep it fresh, you keep it hygienic for the horse. It's like that, it takes work, it's effort, it's dirty. You gotta do what you gotta do, you know? It's part of it. 